mean energy expressed in terms of the partition function. Consider any system, no matter how complicated, in thermal equilibrium with a heat reservoir at the absolute temperature T. The probability that the system is in any one of its states R of energy E sub R is then given by the canonical distribution. So let's remember what was canonical distribution. Probability of occupancy of state with energy E sub R is a constant C times E to the minus beta E sub R, the energy of that state where beta is equal to 1 over kT and this probability actually comes from uh, the number of accessible states for energy E sub R divided by total number of accessible states. So this we obtained uh, from uh, the ratio of the number of accessible states. Okay. Obtain an expression for the mean energy of the system in particular show that the arguments used in section 47 are generally applicable and derive the general result E bar is equal to minus del ln Z over del beta Z is the partition function of the system Okay, so we have the canonical distribution probability is c times e to the minus beta e sub r the mean value of the energy of the system can be found by c sum over r e r e to the minus beta e sub r so we have to multiply the value uh, the corresponding values with the probabilities and we also have the normalization of the probabilities sum of sum over r p r going over all possible states all the probabilities should be adding up to one this is called normalization condition so that uh, we have c times sum over r e to the minus beta e r equals to one uh, therefore c is equal to one over uh, sum over r e to the minus beta e sub r and uh, we define the partition function as sum over r e to the minus beta e sub r uh, so that uh, c is equal to 1 over the partition function then we find that the mean energy of the system e bar is equal to sum over r uh, e r e to the minus beta e sub r divided by sum over r e to the minus beta e sub r also we're, uh, we're talking about non-degenerate states uh, here so this is non-degenerate and this is going to give us uh, if z is defined like this if you look at the derivative of z with respect to beta you can see that the derivative will give us minus er sum over r minus er e to the minus beta e sub r so uh, the factor that appears on top here in the numerator is basically uh, minus the derivative of the partition function with respect to beta and uh, on the other hand the the denominator is the partition function so we find that the mean value of the energy of the system is minus 1 over uh, z del z del beta uh, and you can basically recognize that this is minus del natural logarithm of z with respect to beta because if you calculate del ln z del beta this is uh, first the derivative with respect to uh, z uh, and then the derivative del ln z del z and then the derivative of this uh, with respect to beta so it would be del 
del beta of uh, del ln z del z del ln z del z is uh, 1 over uh, z so this would be uh, del del beta of So let's let's do this again. Del ln z del beta is first the derivative with respect to uh, z, uh, one over z, and then the derivative with respect to beta, uh, del z, del beta. So uh, this is one over uh, positive value of one over z del z del beta, which is basically uh, what we recognize here, but there's a minus sign, so uh, if you uh, adapt this to here, you see that we have to insert a minus sign. So E bar is equal to minus del ln z del beta. So indeed, we find the result that is suggested in the problem uh, statement. Okay, so... Uh, if we consider any system uh, that is in thermal equilibrium with a heat reservoir, small system where the canonical distribution applies, the probability of occupancy of a state R is proportional to E to the minus uh, energy of that state divided by KT, Boltzmann constant times absolute temperature. And the mean value of the energy is found by multiplying the corresponding values of the energy values and their corresponding probabilities, e to the minus beta er values, this for non-degenerate case. Since the probabilities should be normalized, if I go through the probabilities of occupancy of all possible states, the total probability should be 1. So I find that this constant c is 1 over uh, the partition function, what I call the partition function. So the mean value of the energy is that 1 over the partition function, and I see that the top uh, expression, sum over r e to e r e to the minus beta e r, is actually del z del beta, uh, explicitly calculated here. So uh, the answer is minus 1 over z del z del beta. Well, that is actually the derivative of ln z with respect to beta. So first we have to take the derivative of ln z with respect to z and then z with respect to beta. Uh, that gives us uh, the derivative of ln z with respect to beta. So this is uh, del ln z del z del z del beta using the chain rule. So we have to do it in two steps and that gives us 1 over z del z del beta, but we have the minus sign, so the mean energy is minus del ln z del beta. Uh, 